The very first Oscars had two big winners, but only one is remembered. Hey everybody, I'm Adam Martinetti, and when it comes to the Oscars, we all know they're never wrong. Right? At the very first Academy Awards in 1929, there were two notable films for interesting reasons. William A. Wellman's Wings and F.M. Murnau's Sunrise, A Song of Two Humans. Wings took home the Academy Award for Outstanding Picture, a category which later became Best Picture. Sunrise, A Song of Two Humans also took home a major award that night in a category that no longer exists called Unique and Artistic Picture, an award that was created to honor films that had some degree of experimentation to them. F.M. Renau is perhaps best known for his work on the horror classic Nosferatu, and Sunrise, A Song of Two Humans was another big work of his. The film not only won Unique and Artistic Picture, but it also took home the Best Cinematography Award, as well as being nominated for Best Art Direction. Janet Gaynor, who starred in the film as The Wife, took home the award for Best Actress, so it wasn't like the film wasn't highly regarded by the Academy at the time in many aspects. A partial but important reason Sunrise isn't remembered as well as Wings is, is that less than a year after the first awards, the Unique and Artistic Pictures category was cut, with only Outstanding Picture remaining. In 2018, the Oscars announced that they would be introducing a category of Best Popular Film to go along with Best Picture, to get involvement and viewership from a broader audience. However, there was a lot of backlash, and they eventually backed down. For a full background on the interesting history of the situation with Sunrise and Wings, check out the article linked in the description below. I'm Adam Martinetti, and don't forget to head over to Collider.com for your movie news, trailers, and reviews. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you later.